Right here, I just want to post his end of the floor, the first thing, which I'm just going to slide inside and then post his end of the floor. Then I'm going for his head. Why? Because the moment that I go for his head, he's going to need to posture up. And the thing he does, you see, he uses both hands on the floor. So the moment he does this, I'm going for his arm. And then I can catch. From here, one thing that I see uh, some people do, they try to lock the arm as tight as possible. But the thing is, when you're on no gi, like with a short sleeve or when you're wet, like kind of sweat, the arm slides very easily to the outside. If he tries to remove the arm, it slides very easily. So the thing that I like to do to trap the arm here, is I lock my elbow as tight as possible to my rib here. And now it's gonna be a kind of hard to remove the arm yep. and also to prevent even a little uh to make it a little uh, a little harder for him to remove the arm what i do i use my other hand here on the head here he cannot posture up and he cannot remove the arm now he can start 